Good morning, everyone. Today I'm making a bento for my daughter and my wife. First, I'm going to cook rice for one cup, which is enough for two. Today's main dish is swordfish with the soy sauce and curry. First, I'm going to put the salt on the fish, both sides. And I'm going to set it aside for 10 minutes or so. Now I'm going to go ahead and make a salad with the sesame dressing. I got these vegetables from farmer who is specialized in uh, natural farming. They don't even use the uh, even uh, organic fertilizer. These are Japanese mustard spinach, which is komatsuna. I'm gonna boil them with uh, salt and boil them in uh, salted water for 20 seconds or so and put them into ice water which makes the, this green color really vibrant. I'm gonna cut carrots which is ninjin. I'm gonna just slice them and cut them into sticks. I also cut uh, mustard spinach into same length as the carrots. Now I'm gonna make a dressing. This is white sesame paste, which is shironeri goma. Also add brown sugar, which is soseto, and dark soy sauce, which is koiku shoyu. Also I'm gonna add black sesame seeds, which is kuro goma. I'm adding this kuro goma for decoration and crunchiness and flavor. Now I'm gonna mix well and this is done. It's very colorful. I think this is very nice for bento. Now I'm gonna make a sweet egg omelet uh, which is tamagoyaki and today I'm gonna add aonori. First I'm gonna put brown sugar which is soseto and a milk which is gyunyu and this is white condensed dashi, which is shiro dashi. And this dashi is made from bonito flakes, scalp, shiitake mushroom, soy sauce, and sweet rice wine. So shiro dashi is, uh, is very condensed, so it's very salty and has a strong dashi flavor. So when we use it, uh, we usually add the water. But for my tamagoyaki, I'm not adding uh, any water since I'm just using a little bit of dashi. Now I'm adding this uh, aonori, which is the raw seaweed. This is from Lake Hamanako. Today I'm adding this to tamago mixture, um, but you can also make a miso soup with uh, Aonori as well. You just need to add only aonori to uh, dashi and miso. Then you have wonderful miso soup. Also in Japan, we mix aonori with uh, cream and salt and add pasta, which uh, become a very delicious pasta dish as well. I'm gonna add the uh, rest of tamago mixture so traditionally uh, when you make tamagoyaki we add tamago mixture a few times like what i'm doing now but when i don't have time i just put all the mixture at once and just make tamagoyaki but if you uh, add tamago mixture separately a few times uh, you will see beautiful layer when you cut tamagoyaki. So this is almost done. I'm gonna put lid on it to steam a little bit. This is a salt fish that I salted and because of the salt, the fish is sweating. You see water. Taking out of the liquid from surface it will reduce the fishy smell. Now I'm going to cover the fish with uh, cornstarch, which is uh, katakuriko. 
Covering with the cornstarch, it will make uh, make it crispy when I stir fry, and also the sauce will stick better. I'm taking out any excess uh, cornstarch. I'm using the rice oil, which is kome abura, and butter. When it's melt completely, I'm gonna add the fish. I'm not going to cook through completely here. Um, I just cook halfway and take it out, make a sauce, and put back the fish and cook uh, completely. So this is half cook, so I'm gonna make a sauce. This is curry powder without chili. I'm gonna add some uh, brown sugar, which is soseto. And finally, I'm gonna add dark soy sauce. Koiku shoyu. And put back the fish. And cook through. And this is done. Now the tamagoyaki is uh, ready, so I'm going to wrap it with the kitchen paper to take out any moisture. And I'm going to cut it. So aonori stays green, so it's very nice color and tastes good as well. My daughter is awake. I need to be hurry. So I'm gonna cut the fish in small pieces because it will not fit into bento box. And the rice is ready. Nice and fluffy. The rice is still hot, so I'm gonna put the kitchen paper and just cool down a little bit. I'm gonna put everything into a bento box. This is the youngest daughter is talking. She wakes up early sometimes and she starts to demand that she wants like cheese, she wants sausage, she's thirsty and stuff like that. So I need to be hurry. This is salted plum, uh, umeboshi. I wanted something red in bento. So I'm putting it. So this is done. I think it looks good. Okay, thank you very much for watching. Uh, I hope you enjoy today's video. I hope you give a try. I think curry powder, soy sauce, and fish, and butter. It's something that I think uh, many of you might have access to it. So, okay, thank you very much. Bye-bye.